nice of you to drop in, and just in time for a song. Cleaning down through the gates, watch the night suffocate all the light that smothers the sun. I can tell by the moon you'll be joining me soon as a guest in my fortress of fun. And I can't wait to see you and once again free you, release from your humorous air. Someday I will replace that big frown on your face with a smile and a murderous glare. We are two of a kind, violent, unsound of mind. You're the yin to my yang. What is up all you comic book fans, it's the comic book villain coming to you with another comic book haul. This is my 252nd comic book haul for January 1st, I mean, uh, January 6th, 2021. I uh, hope everybody had a nice, safe uh, New Year's, e uh, New Year's. Um, like I said, I hope everybody makes it out to local LCS's and gets what they want, finds what they're looking for. Uh, put the jokers back. Get these jokers back over there. Got a big. They sent me home, of course, with the diamond. In the diamond. This this might be a two 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 armor on this one. This one might be a two armor. Hold on. I'm going. Yep, it is. I'm gonna have to drop it. Okay, have to drop it to get it going. That was a two. That was a two armor today. A lot of books came out today. Ton of books. Ton of books. Ton of people pissed off. A certain book was sold out. And they couldn't get their copy. They didn't get a copy. And some places were just freaking charging. Uh up charging their shit so I mean I understand it's their shit they need to make money but I don't know I mean it's it's, it's kind of hard to say cause, uh, since I am a customer but to me it's like kind of screwing the customers <laughs> you know after a while you keep doing that I mean because they, they do it you know they just you know, book is hot, it's short, everybody wants it. They they look up on eBay, say this is what it's going for, selling for this. It's like, Jesus, this is, it hasn't even came out yet. It's, you know what I mean? You're already putting up the price. And, and like I said, I'm all for LCS's, you know, making money, of course, because I spend a ton of money at the one that I go to. You all know that. So, but, you know, for them to mark up their prices just because eBay, you know, like I said, hey, next and it's and it's not like i said i have no problem paying higher prices for ratios one in seven one in ten one in fifteen one in twenty five you know because you know that that's what they pretty much go for because like right now you can find some of these 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 ratio covers that didn't really go anywhere from two years three years ago and they're going like one in twenty five you can pick them up for you know if it was if it wasn't a hot uh, a, a key issue the, don't get me wrong, the, the cover might be badass, the artist, the artist might have been super awesome, that's why people bought the cover, or bought the book, it's 1 in 25, 1 in 50, whatever, you find these books, you know, for like 15, 12 bucks, 10 bucks now, you know, because they really don't hold, so, when they do what they do to these, it's like, you know what, man, two, I'm just saying, two months from now, okay, I paid 15 bucks for it, two months from now, you can start finding them, you know, 10 bucks, you know, 12 bucks, or even less, and then or two years down the road, like if nothing happened, nothing major goes on with it, you know, yeah, you, you're back down to five bucks, but you've done paid three times what the cover is for it. Uh, let me see what I got. I'm rambling on there. Sorry about that little rant, guys, but you know, I feel I feel some of the customers that are out there that are like, oh, save that one, save that one, okay. It's like I said, I got a ton of books today. A big old ton. Let me move this back. And he didn't put them in plastic bags, but this box is literally. Let me show you. There's a diamond box right there. You see a diamond box? 
it is literally full to the top. See, here's the edge right here. There's my comics. I think I picked up like 60 some comics today. I don't know. I, don't know. I gotta double check, but anyway. Let's go ahead and get started on this on this haul. See where everything is at. These ain't in order, like I said, so I'm just gonna I'm not saying they're in order. This is uh this one is actually what the fuck is this? Let me see. This one is of course I know this is issue number one, but this is this is according to this, this is issue number one B cover. I think this is Greg Land. Yeah, it is. The Greg Land cover. So this is the Eternals. There was quite a few covers. This cover right here is the... Hmm, kind of hard to say what cover this is. Because it's one and one. Uh, I'm not too sure. But anyway, I really like this cover. It was cool. So I had him pull me two of these. I like that cover right there. That's the Essentials number one. And then this one right here, I believe, this is, well, this is the B cover. I don't know. This is just craziness right now because it has one, two, two. Usually the last, the last number is usually the printing. I don't think this is the second printing. It usually is. That's usually the way it works. So then this one, of course, this is a Campbell. This one is J. Scott Campbell right there. Had to get that one. That was a nice one. Oh, it hit the damn thing again. And then this one right here was a nice one. I'm trying to remember who did this one. Who did this one? Uh, I think it was. Trying to see who did this cover for you. I forgot who it was. God damn it. But that was a nice looking cover right there too. So I had him pull me that one. Alright. Let's see what else is out here. Let's see. Man, and then they showed the picture. This looks just a little different from what the picture. Because they showed, I guess in the picture that I saw, it showed the alien. A little bit more of the alien. But anyway, this is the alien versus cover right here. Of course, this is the B cover, I believe. This is number, what is it, number 11? Well, according to this, this is D. 11, A, B, C, D. Yeah, D. The D cover, but that's store number 11 right there. <laughs> then, of course, this is, I believe this is, yep, this is the A11111. That's the A cover right there. Say, got a ton of books, ton of books, ton of books. All right, get those right there. Hey, hey. put that there. <sighs> this cover was sold out on some uh, some of the online stores. I'm not too sure why, but I, I mean, this was a nice looking cover. Don't get me wrong, but this is Venom number thirty two. This is the A cover. I did have him pull me that. This is uh, the C cover, according to this. Is this the B cover? 32, number 4, D. Shows to be D cover, but this was by Ryan. This is by Ryan Brown. Uh, I forgot who did this. Is this Stegman? I think this is Stegman. And then this one, I forgot who did that one. But that was a nice looking one, too. So, got all three of them. I had to pull me all three of them. Oh, let me get this out of here. It's getting thick. It's getting thick. Uh oh. My doggy. My doggy's barking. All right. Let's see. Where's the other one? All right. Gardens of the Galaxy. This is number 10. This is the A cover right here. I like this cover. They had the Alien. I think they had the Alien versus one. And I didn't really like that one. So, I just like that one right there. So, I got the A cover on that one. Uh, uh, alrighty. Now, 
this one right here is and I was gonna grab another one I should have this one right here is return of the Valk return of the Valkyries of course this one right here has a uh, Uh, this one has a first appearance. This is the first team appearance of the Valkyries. Um, <clears throat> Jane, Fro Jane Foster, Hildegard, Dana, and Monster, some shit like that. And then, and four, is it four? And I think four, I think it was four new Valkyries as well. But like I said, this is a new first appearance of... Of the Valkyries. I was going to pick up more than one, but I didn't. So, we'll flip to that one. Okay. Put that one there. Let's see. This one right here. This is um, from IDW Marvel uh, Action Avengers number three. Um, I've been digging this one. I know people are saying, "Oh, it's a, you know, it's the kids, uh, a kids one," but I've been enjoying the storyline. It's pretty cool. So, give you a little insight to this. Love this book. This book is nice and heavy. Paper is mm -hmm. like thick. So, <clears throat> number three. Let me see something real quick. All right, just have to check something out real quick. Okay, and then <clears throat> Miles Morales number twenty-two. Miles Morales Spider-Man number twenty-two came out today. This is the A cover, and then this is the B. The alien, alien versus variant cover right there. That's a nice looking cover as well. I don't think there's anything specifically happening on in this issue that I'm aware of. Oh, here is a new one right here. Um, this one is by um, Aftershock Comics. This one right here. This is Scout's Honor. I remember reading it in the. In the previous magazine, and then I did, I did have them pull me to. I didn't pre-order it, but I knew they were gonna get some, so I just had them pull me. Let's flip through. This will be our first time. I didn't look through it while I was there at the store. I like these. These are real thick. These are real thick. A uh, 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 cardboard stock, almost like a. Uh, oh wow, like a cardboard stock. A uh, 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 um, covering cover. Wow. Looks pretty cool. Scout's Honor. Can't wait to read that. <clears throat> Let's see. Kind of that's number one. I'm not too sure what number this is, but anyway. This is uh, Spider Woman number eight. This is the A cover right here. And I believe this is, this is according to this, this is a C cover. Uh, nice looking cover right there. See if I can hold it up right. That is a nice looking cover right there. Was there something going on in Spider Woman? I think there was something. No, nothing going on in Spider Woman. No, I guess not. Hmm. Flip through it anyway. Next month. <laughs> Hello, Jessica. Buddy, you've, you've been looking for me. <laughs> Alrighty. Oh, let me see. This one, huh, maybe not. This is uh, Symbiote Spider-Man number three. This is the A cover. 
I got two of the egg covers. Because this might be cameo or first appearance of this girl. I just flip through it real quick. See what we see. And raccoon. Rocket raccoon. Alright, let's see. King wait. King wait. King. For my patient, oh wonder what I put this over. Captain Marvel, not anymore. Nah, Captain Marvel is a knee guy. Cap, you okay? No, I'm not sure. Spider Man, yep. <laughs> Minutes later. Who would I rule everyone would be dead? Shut up. Hmm. Oh, I believe his name is Ulick. Ulick. I guess this is his first appearance of Ulick. I believe his name is Ulick. See his name up there at the top. Hmm. Next issue, Ulick is in the house. Be here for. Be here in 34, the battle in. Hmm. Well, let me get all these up. Well, like I said, it looks like there was a first appearance or whatever cameo of a eunuch. All right, this one right here, this is. Uh, Star Wars number 10. I should. And I was going to grab another one, another A cover, but I didn't. Well, have him pull me one. This right here, Star Wars number 10, has a first uh, first team appearance of the Starlight Saber Squad. Saber Squad? Starlight Squadron. Excuse me, Starlight Squadron. This one is Star Wars number 10. First appearance of Starlight Squadron. Flip through it with you. It's Transformers. Lando Carizia. So, of course, what's that then? I guess that's them. Wedge Adderley, Feltisman, Lolo Larmer, Sarah Bell, Bell, Bale, Hanker, and Martin. So that might be them right there. Oh yeah, all right, Starlight Squadron. Yep, that's them. They're right there. That's the Starlight Squadron right there. So, that's their... First appearance of Star Wars number 10. All right, here is another good one right here. Which one's this one? This one's number... This is the C cover. And this one is the B cover. Did I get another one? Let me just double check. Yeah, there it is. I did, yeah, I thought I got all three. This is Amazing Spider-Man number 56. The A cover right here. That's the Alien versus cover, you want to call it. A nice looking cover right there. And then of course this one right here. Man, this one was a nice cover. Could not could not not take that one too. So I had me pull that one. Had him pull me that one right there. So and like I said when I'm when I get to a couple of more books, I'm gonna be telling you about them like that what they were doing. I was like, what? 
No way. You got to be shitting me. <clears throat> but they were like, yep. We sure are. And I was like, holy crap. I was about to tell them, go back themselves. A lot of goodies, a lot of goodies. Some of these books are super thick. Uh, which one is this one? This one is. Okay. Bear with me, guys. Bear with me. Those were free. Right there. Let me throw this back in there. This goes over here. I'm just moving stuff around, guys. Apologize. I apologize. 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 This is Generation Shatter number one. This is the B cover. I think this was an eight ninety nine book. No, nine ninety nine book. So I just picked up this one, the B cover. I think it's supposed to say where all the state of the characters of the old DC characters are at. You mess with the wrong town. So can't wait to read that. I just hate square bound books because when you open to read them you most definitely gonna crack alrighty I, I know there's one of them but they put both of them in in these uh god damn it hold on son of a bitch oh. that hot uh, hot valley days and cocaine nights they put them both in these black cover bags. I know there's one that's a risque cover. Let me see, is this one it? I don't think this one's it. Yeah, I think this is just a regular A cover, so I can show this. Because apparently, I guess she's not going to have, this is going to her be showing her, her nipples. But this one right here is, like I said, First one was pretty crazy. Yeah, like I said, so they put both of them. This is a thick ass book. Because this one is actually marked B. Let me see what it, let me see what it looks like before I show it to you because I don't wanna I don't wanna get people in the uproar. uproar. Let me see. It God damn it. Jesus Christ. Well, get the fuck. Oh my god. It's like this motherfucker didn't want to come out. Oh yeah. oh yeah. Yeah, that's all it is. It just shows her nipples. <laughs> and they drew... If they were to do it the same... They drew these nipples like really big. Because even if they were to draw them the same size and just covered them with that, they would be sticking out a lot more. But anyway. But 
but yeah, like I said, this one has the, this one. It's the same picture, just as she's showing her nips. That's it. So put those back right there. That's the B cover. Right there. And here is another one. They had this cover right here. Of course, I got all these at cover price. They had this, I want to say, for $14.99. This is the Dark Knight Death Metal number seven. Of course, this is the first cameo appearance of the Amazonian Wonder Woman. Oh, that's right. This has what somebody said it's in the back. Hmm. I'm gonna have to read this, but anyway, yeah. So I saw that there. They had those up. That one was up charged for fourteen ninety nine. This is the D cover right here. It's a nice looking badass color cover right there. This one is the A B. This is the B cover. That's a nice looking one right there too. So those are the three that I got. Let me get these out. Oh, oh I moved the camera. Let me get these out real quick. It's starting to get thick. So sorry about that, guys. I moved the damn camera. All righty. Of course, here he made his first appearance in the holiday special, DC holiday special. And this is, what is it, Quick Quick Silver? Quick Kid Quick, I think his name was, or is. So this is going to be his first, I guess, title or whatever, because like I said, he made a first appearance already in that one shot. So, of course, I got two of the A covers right there. Yes, sir. Two of these nice-looking B covers. Look pretty freaked out. Right there. And then that nice looking uh, Wonder Woman 84 cover. And this is Future State Flash right here. Man, she looks she looks like her big time in that picture. So that right there is a Future Flash right there. Oh yeah, and then uh, also Wally West turns evil in this issue. Yes, sir. Which one is this one? This is okay. Now this is one thick ass book. I'm not too sure. Um, I just know this is. This one has a first appearance, first team appearance of the magistrate, first team appearance of Arkham Knights. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Looks like there's five members. So this is the future state. The next Batman. Man, this is a thick ass book, but $7.99 for this book too. How much is that one was four ninety nine? Interior art, it's okay. I mean pretty good I think it's a to me I mean don't get me wrong I like it but I think it's a little little weak a little little weak for such like a big book like a big new event type of book 
I think I would have got it the interior art a little stronger. But looks good nevertheless. Wow, can't wait to read that. So that is the Batman Future State. Yes, I did. I got two covers of the A. And I got two covers of this B cover right here. Yes, sir. Man, these are some thick books. They're not going to fit. Nope. Let me take them out. Because these are, these are real thick-ass books. And then, of course, I did get that... This is from J. Scott Campbell. This is the Future State Next Batman number one. Could not not get that that Future State Wonder Woman. And this one right here is this one has shitload of first appearances. This is the Future State Swamp Thing number one. First appearance of Swamp Thing Supreme. First cameo appearance of. Woodrow Wilson, the Undying Man, first cameo of Obsining Ob Sun, Obsining Sun, first appearance of Indigo, Verk, Kala, uh, their first cameo, first cameo appearance of Bog Bogon Bogran. So that is has quite a few. This is Swamp Thing, Future Quest, Swamp Thing, number one. Let's flip through it a little bit. Let's flip through it a little bit. Swamp Thing created by... Look at that. Swamp Thing. The, the Obsidian Sun. Hmm. Rocks. So, you know, this is some nice interior art. Should have hit that one up on the... Should have hit this interior art on the Batman, too. Or the interior artists. So, yep, I got two copies of that A cover and then two copies of the B cover. I think these are uh, three of the new characters. Their first appearances and cameos are on there. And then, these are, some, like I said, some thick ass books. Thick ass books. Superman of uh, Metropolis. This has the first appearance of Brain Cell. And first appearance of Honest Mary. Two first appearances in this one in the Superman Metropolitan. Met <laughs> Metropolis. Jesus Christ. I was trying to say fucking Metro. I was trying. My head was trying to. My mouth was trying to say Metropolitan. Jesus Christ. Met Metropolis. Flip to this one too. Mama. Nice, nice interior art. Brainiac. Supergirl. <laughs> car yes <laughs> sound like someone was having some sex up in that thing yes car yes keep going don't stop won't stop get it get it It's Mr. Miracle. That's a comic. In here. Mr. Miracle. That is pretty cool, but that is Superman of 
Metropolis. There's the two A covers, and there's these two nice covers right here by Inhokali. Inhokali, Inhokali. And then, of course, And then the Harley Quinn, Future State Harley Quinn. This is the number one, I mean the A cover. Got two copies of that bad boy right there, yes sir. Uh oh, it's getting kind of thick, let me take these out. And then of course, I did get two of the, the nice looking B covers right there. There wasn't too anything too specific going on in Harley Quinn. Uh, but let's see, what else do I got? Alrighty. Let me see. Ah, oh, god damn it. Hold on, guys. Alrighty. And then crossover number three came out today. This is, I believe this is regular A cover right there. Let me double check. Yep, 3-1. Yep, it is. That is a regular A cover. You got the thick hard stock. Thick covers. Let's see. Hmm, that looks like Doctor Strange right there. People keep talking about, I wonder if there's going to be a, you know, going to see any any of the superheroes from DC or Marvel or something in here so man I'm still waiting for my figures to get here my spawn that uh, what do you call it the one where you where you buy into it where they where the customers pretty much fund the fund the 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 money to for the to do it. God damn it, my fucking mind's throwing a blank now. Ah, damn it. A Kickstarter, there you go, the Kickstarter. Waiting for my Kickstarter spawns to come here. Can't wait till I get those bad boys. I the Kickstarter when it first I ended up I got all three. So looks like I should be getting some nice stuff. Hmm. I'm just flipping through here to make sure just to see. Oh, that ain't no doctor. Strange. Huh. Oh, that's what's his name? Been much for Cape so. <laughs> then the three dots. The one that Jim from Jim's comments was talking about. The three dots. <laughs> From the spawn, but I only do three dots in a row. I think they were like in more of a triangle, or more of a pick a, a pyramid. Huh. Well, that's that crossover number three. That is the A cover. Then, of course, a lot of y'all know by now. Let's see. That is that one. That is that one. That there was eight. I got three out of the eight of the B cover. Um, I only because I only, I pre-ordered two, so they were gonna just give me two. Then I was, but I told them to make sure this one I pulled off the wall. This is the this is the one where reading God Country, and this one is the one where they're reading the book Cyber Force. This is the the difference. And then of course I told them y'all had to make sure I got that one, the one where they're reading Spawn Number One, right there on the cover. So I told them they need to make sure to get me that one. And they did. They did it. They done did it. Okay. Let's see what else do I got here. Alrighty. And then of course, uh, the first uh, first full appearance of the new Brazilian Wonder Woman is in Future States Wonder Woman. And that's the A cover right there. Uh, a cover. Hmm. 
flip through it. So that is the A cover. Of course, I did get two of the B covers as well. Right there. So, and then of course, this is the one where everybody was flipping out over, flipping out over. This is Star Wars, The High Republic. This one got some crazy, this one has the first appearance of Kiev Trams, the Jedi Padawan, and a full appearance of Avar Chris. Of our Chris. So this is the A cover right here, which my location was selling at cover price. They were limiting these one per customer, which I don't have a problem limiting. I don't have a problem with the limiting. I have a problem when you jack up the prices. When you jack up the prices and it hasn't even been a fucking day yet. So, in my location, they were charging $14.99 for this cover. Just the regular B covers, not even incentive. And they were charging $24.99 for the other cover. But I went to a different location because they this location doesn't... If they have them on the shelf, they're cool. They're, you get them for cover price. So I went in the morning to get it at cover price. Oh, let me get these out. So, they also had this one at cover price. Doom! Yes, sir. It's the one everybody wanted. They're, these were the ones that were sold out. So, and then my LCS guy charged me regular price for mine. Because I did pick it up at my, other, at my LCS. So, he charged me cover price for it as well. Because I'll charge you cover price for it. And I said, I'm good with that. But this is a cover everybody had wanted because, like I said, in, in both locations, in the location where I got this one, I wanted to make sure I was first in line. So I got there really early and I was first in line. And I'm glad because this was the only one that made the shelf. He had about the A covers. He had about maybe five, six A covers. And he had about three or four B covers. The C cover was this was the last one on there. So when I got there, I looked and I grabbed it and I grabbed uh, then I grabbed the B cover. And then when I was at the other location, I was telling him about it. I said, dude, you serious this much? And he was all like, nah, I worry about it. Take care of it. So, so I got my two. Because you know how the villain do. The villain got to get his two. So, I ended up getting my two. I ended up getting my two uh, copies of this bad boy. Right there. And you know what? course i gotta give you a cover of the week and what do you think it's gonna be guys yes sir star wars the high republic number one c cover is my cover of the week with yoda on it yes sir that is going to be my cover of the week and that's all the books i got right yep that was it that's all the books yes sir toy was gonna be a big big haul and it was um, that's all I got guys like I said man this was my 252nd uh, comic book haul for 
uh, January 6, 2021. Like I said, man, I hope everybody makes it out to local OCSs, gets what they want, finds what they're looking for. And uh, remember, still with this pandemic going on, and then they're talking about the new strand that's popping up in the United States now. Y'all really need to be careful, be safe, you know, do whatever you got to do, stay away from each other, you know, remember, mask, wash your hands, but most of all, wash that ass. The comic book villain out. Till next week, laters.